Hello everybody and welcome to another book review. Today I am here to review The Complete Cheese Sweet Home, Part 1. So I recently just got this book a couple of, well not a couple of days, like, well by the time I upload this video it would probably be a couple of days, so like a couple of days ago. And I don't know, I was just looking around because I was just bored at my local bookstore and I stumbled across this book. And when I first saw it, I freaked out because I've seen this cat before in anime shows or something or like in an anime place somewhere. I don't know where. It just stuck out and the image just stuck in my mind and I told myself, I've seen that picture before. Where have I seen that? And I opened it up and it was exactly what I thought and it was Chi. And if you guys don't know what Chi or who Chi is, it's about um, this little cat right here who name is Chi. It's kind of funny, I'm not going to spoil how uh, her name gets spoiled, but it's just, uh, it's about like the Hamada family, Yamada, yeah, Yamada family, who takes this little cat in where, where um, Chi lo loses her mother. And they take care of Chi, but the apartment they live in, they're not allowed to have pets. So it's just about the crazy adventures that they have. And this isn't the whole um, book. This I don't really know really how many volumes are in this book. But this is part one. It's not all the books combined. There's another one coming out. But sadly, the other one's not coming out until like like January 26th so that kind of sucks but just kind of stuck out to me about like how much this stuck out and it's very cute and the best thing about this manga is because it has all the previous um mangas to it because the first ones that they first released they were all like oh, I'm trying to remember they're all like little little mangas but the, this is like one big manga, so like, yeah, you're paying a little bit more for this book, but you're, you know, you're getting more out of it, and it's like, it's better instead of you buying separate books, and it doesn't clutter too much. So I'll just get into this. I'm not going to show too much here, because it's something that I don't really want to show that much, because, you know, it's just something that you guys, if you want to check out, you can. And it's color illustrated, which is very nice because all mangas, almost every single manga that I've seen, they are almost all in black and white. And, I mean, that's fine and all, but it would be nice to have some colored ones. So, this is a very good book if you like Cheese Sweet Home. Um, as far as I'm concerned, there is no, there is an anime show of this. But, you know, it's like every other anime, animal animes, there's not a whole lot of them, and there's only a, a couple that I like. I like anime, but the only ones that I like are like ones with like animals in them. I don't know, I think that the animal ones kind of show a little bit more, like Ginga the Satsud Weed and Ginga Legend Weed, which is like just the English version, like that one, that one. Oh my gosh, guys, I couldn't tell you how how hard that was to find that book. I was searching everywhere, and I got lucky on that one. <laughs> like I said, it, it was lucky. And then this one, I don't know how I stumbled across this. This one was like, oh my gosh, I had to get it. Like, I knew that, like, once I saw it, I'm like, you know what? I need to get this, because if I leave this now, it will always be... It, I don't know if I'll ever find it again, but it just... It was released, it's just I really wanted it right away, so I broke down and I bought it. And I'm just going to show you the price now. It wasn't cheap, I'm going to tell you that. But I would definitely spend the money that it's worth to get it, instead of buying all those little mangas. I don't actually have the little mangas, because I just previously saw this book. So as you see on the price of this book, it is real tape for twenty four ninety five in the US and twenty seven ninety five in Canada but it came up a bit more it was like about thirty bucks for my situation and it was very very it was worth every penny because if you see the size of this book 
it will give you hours good to read, but like I said, it doesn't have every single um, manga to it, so unfortunately they are making a second one, but it's not coming out till next year, and I'll show on the back there, and I'll give you more encounters about what's happening, but I'm not going to show you anymore. And then there was this really cool um, other thing that they had in here. I guess I could show this one, because this one I don't know. I don't know. It's called Introducing... Fuku Fuku, I think that's what its name is. I'm not too sure if that's what it is. But there's just like a little manga section here, Fuku Fuku. And uh, I think it's supposed to be another anime of this guy who made this. Sorry, this is kind of... I have to hold this with one hand. I, I didn't know that he made like other cat mangas. And it's just like about like this cat with this older lady. I don't know if there's mangas out there of this cat in like I'm obviously probably in Japanese but there's none in English as I know but yeah anyways guys thank you for um, watching this video I am looking forward to making more I got a lot of great stuff to review for you guys um, yeah, so, no more cheese stuff, though, because this is, like, the only one I have, but definitely worth buying, but there would be another one, but it will probably always be $30, but I, it's worth every penny. Anyway, guys, um, that's it for this video. Like and subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.